guys, Mike here with 2 0 Scrapping. Uh, today we're going to be doing this. What is this? A toaster oven, broiler, some kind of toaster. I'm not sure, but it's really dirty in here. So, first thing I'm going to do is going to get all this crap out of here. This is all going to be steel. That's with the magnet, see? It all sticks. Ferris bucket. Alright, what else? Got this tray in there. Some more Ferris. I'm just gonna throw that down there. Alright. So now, like any other thing, we're gonna start taking off any screws we see. So we're gonna have all these here. So we're just gonna go around real quick. Any more over here? Nope. Now we're gonna get a screwdriver. Oh, this thing's sticky and gross. And we're just gonna go around. Oh man, I almost dropped this drill. Around it, popping it out, looking to see if there's any more screws. There we go. Pull out the axes. I'm just going to cut this. This line here, like this joint. Hold on, can you see that? Oh, no. Nope. Right there. Cut that, that way I can get this little piece out. Alright, some more tin. There's that cord. Set it aside. Oh, I fell on the ground. Alright, it's really simple, there's not much to it, Just flip it the other way, oh this thing's gross, and do the same thing on this side, just like that, there's the top, I'm just gonna set all that metal over here. Alright. So there's gonna be some screws here I missed on the bottom. I probably should have taken all those out. That's pretty quick with this drill. No problem. around and take the rest out. Now it should really come apart. Yeah, there's the sides. Here's the other side. Alright, now we have this inner piece. So can we uh, take these wires off without taking it any more apart? Yeah. We took all these nozzles. And see if we can just take these screws off here and they'll come all apart. So these are going to have switches in them, which contain silver, and the rest we can just clip off with these. I think these are just the, the heater. Yeah. So let's go to the that heater core there inside that heats up. So I'm just going to go ahead and clip those ends here. Clip the bottom ones off. This bottom one off, and then here we clip this off. Just 
pull it off the connection there. And then you get this bundle here and you just clean it up. You know, cut all the wires as close as possible and then take the switches apart later. This is where the, well, oh, uh, well, here's another one. And just clip that as close as you can. And then these I'm just going to throw with my other switches in there. I'm just going to, well, with my number two insulate it. You can clip off these ends here, get the brass. There's one, there's two. This is just, just like the extension cord safety thing so you don't pull the cord all the way out. And just take that apart like that. And what else am I going to take from this? That's it. You throw this with your number two, insulate it, and then here, cut myself. Here you're going to have two silver contacts. Oh, you can see that. Hold on. Let me zoom in. Alright, I try to zoom in as best as possible, but here on these... Uh, I don't know if you can see that. Oh, shit. Alright, where, where are you at, camera? Alright. Right here, you see these two little contacts here? Right there. Let me fold that back. You can have two silver contacts there. I'll just take this, peel this back a little bit so you can see what I'm talking about. And there's one, and the other one's on the other side. Right there, see that? Those are going to be silver contacts, so you want to get those off. Man. Taking the screw off. Look at that. Holy crap. That's going to be aluminum. Alright, so. Let's see. There's the two silver contacts. Right there. There's one. You see it? Right there. And the other one's on the other side. So you want to keep these. And put it with the other rest of your silver contacts. I'll get that cut out later. But other than that, let's see. Let's cut this wire off here. You can add that to your number two. Insulate it. A little two strands. There. And then these heater cores can go with with the other ones I got from that. You see these heater cores here. Well, let me zoom back out. All right. These heater cores can go with the other heater cores, like the ones that took off that, uh, that waffle machine and the grilling machine. They're also found in, uh, what do you call them, dishwasher. Any other electronic heating devices you can find these in. Let's see, this one seems to be stuck because of this. Oh, there, we go. there you go. Clip that end off. So then we've got four of them. And just add those with the other ones. And this, you can just leave that at as this. And you would put all your trash and all your like ferrous material in there. I'm just gonna open it on the side so be careful. If you have a trailer or something, you just dump it all in there. And then these little two pieces of brass in the brass bucket. And that's about it, guys.
So thanks for watching this video. Um, sorry I didn't make any videos in the past three days. I've been really busy. I had a wedding to go to today. I'm still, I don't know, you see that? Still wearing my, my slacks there. Kind of just changed and got in here real quick to make a video for you guys. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you guys on the next video.